Hey everyone, this is Prince Watercrest, and welcome back to Let's Play Gex 3 Deep Cover Gecko. In the last video, we found everything in Tut TV. I'm gonna go to my totals real quick to ensure that I have. I have. Good. And with that, I can go on and take on another level. But before I do that, there is a bonus area that I can do. All I have to do is just hit all four of these things again. That'll break the gate, and that'll take me to the bonus level. I need eight for this one. I might as well go ahead and do it. Let's see what we got going on. Gextreme Spores, Whack the Five Elves. So, we're doing this again. I finally found out why there are multiple codes for the same stage. Turns out, you have to do the same bonus stages in different locations in order to get other codes. And I do not know why you pushed me all the way over there, but I am totally hitting you for that. So once again, we're doing this. And I might as well just go ahead and show off playing this because this is how we're going to fill some time before we go on to the next area here. And is it me or does this seem harder? Because this seems more difficult. I mean, he is not letting me hit him. Can I hit the elf game? Yes, I know time's running out. Come on! Ah! Get out of the way! Thank you! Good grief! Come on! There we go! I do not like doing this, these, these sorts of things. I do not like having to hit these guys because they just make it harder for you to do virtually everything. Why? Oh, come on. There we go. That should be the fourth one. Where's the fifth one? Don't tell me he's up there. He's up there. Well, at least we're able to find them. Uh, can we hit this guy already? I only have 20 seconds. Come on! There we go. I don't know if it was harder or it was just me. But he just did not want to be hit. At least two of these guys didn't want to be hit. But they're the other code. Now that we've beaten this, what is it? Square, star, triangle, square, triangle, diamond. Yeah, that's the full health code. So we can now officially unlock that in the vault if we need it. And now that this is taken care of, one, I don't have to do Gex Stream Sports ever again. And two, I can just go on to the next stage. I'd like to see if I can get 50 fly coins before I do anything else here. Reason being, I want to get an extra life for just in case. Really want to get another extra life before I go on to the next level. Thankfully, I know how to get to the next level. And it's that army barracks one that we passed by not some time ago. And there was no reason for me to break that because that was how you get a paw print coin and not a fly coin. Also, I need to walk off this. Okay, not exactly what I had in mind, but I'll take it. And from here, getting the 50 that I want should be a snap. Alright, you're there. 
you're there. At least I remembered you this time. Which is important. Because I want to make sure that I get everything up here next. And then I'll probably have to go down there for even more coins. Is there anything over here? If the camera would rotate, that would be fine. I would like that. Okay, we're back down here. We're near the pirate ship. We're not going to go over there for some time. In the meantime, I do want to beat up some enemies. I do want to get this thing over here. I do want to get these things over here. Is it possible to get over there from the top of the ship? Also, I need to go hit these things because I know I'm gonna, no, I'm gonna forget them. I need to remember to hit the hit the palm tree so that way I can get the get the things and get the places and stuff. Okay, I'm gonna go over here again in case I forgot like a palm tree or something, which thankfully is not the case. And with any luck... Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to go ahead... Effectively go over here... Beat you up... Get some more of these coins elsewhere. How am I doing on health? Okay, we're full on health. I'll go ahead and grab this. There. We now have our extra life, which I wanted to get for just in case. Let's go ahead and go into this, ar this waterfall where the army barracks are. And from here, we're going to start the army channel in this episode. So we got three new remotes, as well as another secret one from all 100 fly coins. We have shoot the searchlights, whack five tents, destroy the city, five, find five secret bug crates, and survive the maze, steal secret plans. We're gonna do shoot the searchlights first, because this is going to be right where we start. And you definitely want to stay away from the searchlights or else you're going to get shot at, like so. Thankfully, you can't get hit as long as you stay on the move. And there are some foxholes where you can continue to be at. They're still shooting. And Alfred will tell you, hey, use a machine gun. Just walk up to it. Hold square to shoot, use the control pad to aim, and you should be able to take out the searchlights when you see them. You may also notice the tents with the res logo on them. You'll have to destroy those with the tail whip in order to get the first remote in this stage. Also, we need to go up the water tower here because that's where we're going to find a pot coin. And these things with the red and yellow flashing lights don't do what I did. Make sure you jump clear over them so that way they don't blow up and hit you. And thankfully you can just keep the, the square button held down on the machine guns when you walk up to them. That way you can tell where you're aiming. And thankfully you'll never run out of ammo on those things. Those things have infinite ammo. Good grief. I am not doing very well here. Okay, we've entered some barracks. Shortly after the start, there is a 
wooden building with the number one in white to the left of the door. And you can open the door just by going up to it, and you can enter these barracks full of all these bouncy... Good morning, Menlo Park! Full of all these bouncy beds that you can bounce on for a bunch of fly coins. I'm going to go ahead and consume this fly. Surprise, surprise, surprise. And then get on out of here. To the, on the other side is another barracks saying two. You cannot enter this set of barracks, unfortunately. So that's out in case you're looking for more pickups and whatnot. Speaking of things... There's a soldier. We can shoot him down from a distance. He will throw grenades at you if you were close enough. And unfortunately, you cannot destroy the tank, the uh, tents, with the machine guns. So don't even bother trying to do that. Also, I'm now really seeing a motif between all of the stage musics of this game. There's the last one. And I'm definitely hearing it here. It's definitely familiar from the first stage. Am I destroying all five of the tents? And all the searchlights? Basically, you just have to destroy all the tents. You'll get a cutscene of a military chopper dropping off the TV where you can pick up the remote. And it'll be right over here. Let's go ahead and grab it. So we were able to find 23 fly coins in the area with the first remote alone. We managed to find one fly coin. And we found the entrance to the third remote, which is the maze. Fight, I, think. <laughs> I actually got a good laugh out of that one during the practice run. And, well, there's not much left to do here, so we might as well just go ahead and get another one. We're going to do Survive the Maze and Steal the Secret Plans. And I'm actually going to go ahead and show where the location for this is. And I like, the is gonna muss my hair. I like the fact that when you start the level, you actually get this level-specific effect where you, in the gameplay, start with the gameplay screen showing up like you're turning on an old television. Alright, let's make sure not to mess anything up horribly this time and make sure that we go ahead and grab all the fly coins here. Did I shoot all these? Okay, I will use the ones near... Oh. I used the ones here. I did not use the ones over there. Let's go ahead and go back in the barracks. I want to see if I can get 50 fly coins this time. Because that would be nice. And, yeah. Not really much for me to say here at this point. We pretty much know what to do everywhere around here. And, okay, we still got two more of these fly coins left. As I was saying, not much to say around here. Because we already know what to do at this point. Don't want to step on anything flashing. Do want to destroy the this searchlight here. Do want to grab this. And hopefully not get blown up in the process. That would be good. 
All right. Get rid of you. And you. And you. By the way, you can press the X button to get out of the first person mode and get away from the machine gun. Though, if you do walk towards the machine gun again, you will be in first person mode and manning the guns again. And I can't skip out of this, unfortunately. I have to wait for that cutscene to, to totally finish playing. Oh, and it's a good thing that I got that extra hit because I'm pretty sure I'm going to need it now. So there's 24 in this section and not 23 like I immediately thought. You have to remember, this is sort of a semi-blind let's play and oh boy. Okay. That was a walking grenade. There will be grenades with legs that parachute down into this section. And if you see them, you can't fight them. You either have to kill them with a the machine gun from a distance, which I don't recommend because they'll always follow you. Or you have to... That still hit me. That was a rather wide hitbox. But anyway. You do... Want to maneuver this thing. So. You. So. So. You want to maneuver the, the grenades. You want to get them to move towards the foxhole. Because if they fall in the foxhole, they will fall down and blow up. Also, there was another pop print coin right there, and I wanted to grab it. You definitely. You are definitely going to be switching between. What? hit me I don't even know what hit me right there probably another enemy nope we're not doing that yeah I did get hit over there and I'm not sure why probably another enemy just just hitting me right out of the blue. Probably that soldier that was right there. Near where I landed when I got hit. But we do want to keep using the machine guns. We want to keep going between the upper and lower levels of the stage. Because we're going to find a lot of fly coins in the trenches. And this. Oh, Maybe it was a grenade or something. I'm surprised that hit me from that far away. And I do want to hit this checkpoint because it will make it easier in case I die, which amazingly I have yet to do in this entire Let's Play. Again, I... No, we're not doing that. As I was saying, I've died in practice runs, but not in the actual Let's Play footage proper. And if only... Game. I would like to grab that. Thank you. And I do want to get close. Where's the searchlight? Okay, it's over there. And you are over here now. Apparently, the hitboxes on the grenades are bigger than I would think that they should be. And therefore, I can get hit when I don't think I should be able to get hit. Because of that. Also, another pop ring coin. What is up there? Okay, there's another soldier. Let's go ahead and karate kick him from a distance there. And we can bounce on this tire for yet another one. We will have to bounce on tires. And I forgot all about this. Turns out, you can just climb on this. You can get here for a bonus coin. Now am I doing on health? Okay. Just eat this one. I should be good to go as far as health is concerned. Now, where is the nearest... Okay, there it is. I'm going to go ahead and destroy that searchlight as well. If the game will let me, it will not let me. 
Hmm. Maybe there's another one somewhere in range that I can use. Okay, I didn't get hit there. That's good. We should be able to get Don't these two fly stop. coins as well. Don't get safely. In big, loud war. And now there's going to be enemies here. Mostly searchlights. And I can go ahead and hit this guy too. Might as well go ahead and take care of him. I don't know where any more grenade enemies will land. Though they will be nearby. And I won't have much of a problem with them in case they do show up. And I want to backtrack just to be safe. Yeah, we should be good now. What are you? Are you health? You are health. Okay. Yeah, we should be at max health plus an extra hit now. So I'm doing a lot better now that I know how to jump over these things and I just know better as to how not to die. So with that taken care of, I might as well go down here look through the rest of the foxhole area here. That's a thing. That's a thing. Okay. We need to go over here. And you are going to go towards the foxhole. Okay, you're gone. Okay. And I guess I might as well blow up the searchlight for just in case. I said blow up the searchlight, not blow up the searchlight and run into the machine gun three times. And here's a foxhole. Is there anything back here? There isn't. Other than a please curb your lizard sign on the fence. Okay, that door is not opening. I'm guessing it's because I haven't destroyed every searchlight yet. That's probably the one explanation that makes the most sense. And you know what? I just now realize which gun I have to go to to do that. That should be the only one that I had yet to destroy. That door open for me, no problem in the practice run. Now it's opening. I guess it's because I didn't destroy all the searchlights this time around. Let's go ahead and use the machine gun to take care of the two soldiers. Thankfully, the soldiers never drop fly coins. And from here, we can grab the secret plans. We can tail whip those and grab them. And once again, another military chopper will show up and drop a Resco television. That was amazing, sir. Well done. All we need to do now is leave the command center and the remote will be right in front of us. So, we've got our extra life. I didn't die again. We now have five more paw print coins. We got another bonus coin. We've got two remotes, and we picked up at least 56 fly coins. And we are doing incredibly well with the Army Channel. We've already gotten two remotes so far. That's not too bad. And we picked up a good amount of the secrets as well. But the best will be yet to come. Because in the next video, we're going to complete the army channel, then we're going to check out the bonus area that's in this barracks before we go on to another level. So join me next time, where we finish off army channel war as heck, and then explore another little slice of the game. Until then, this is Prince Watercress, take care, stay safe, and thanks for watching!